We got our first look at Optimus Prime aka Orion Pax from Transformers 1. What? This image of what is supposedly an Orion Pax popcorn bucket has been found and there's a video with it because you can see behind the guy in the black and white suit, Orion Pax. Now if this is actually a popcorn bucket, we can understand why his upper body is so big because if he actually looked like this in the movie, I don't know. Speaking of Transformers, we're getting a Transformers X Bingo Sports Club. Yes, this is real. What? And it looks cool. They got the Optimus Prime paint job. Oh yeah. We got our first look at the official logo for James Gunn's Superman film, which I wouldn't say this is my favorite Superman logo, but it looks slick and clean. Three years ago today, Blue Sky Studios was shut down. Oh, what a sad day that was. What was your favorite Blue Sky Studios movie? You probably already know about the collaboration with Godzilla Kong and Call of Duty and all their skin packs and everything which looks cool, but Call of Duty has a King Kong glove more expensive than the game. Huh? And players aren't happy. Call of Duty's collab with Godzilla Kong The New Empire includes the Beast Glove melee weapon, which costs $80 in COD points to unlock, and players don't seem thrilled about it. I want to be thrilled about it. $80? Did Kong himself have to pay for the glove? No. Why do we have to? What are your thoughts on all this news? Because Orion Pax, I think, is bulking a bit too much.